Hey, what's going on guys? In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make these twist wires. Um, a lot of people make these individually, which in my opinion takes way too much time. So in today's video, I wanna show you guys how I make them. All you need is your standard wire that you normally use. Um, pick you up some of these screw eyes. Um, this is what I got. If you guys want to use the same thing, um, get you a drill. So what you need to do, and you're also, you're going to want to get yourself some of these. Um, you can use any kind of pliers, really, but you are going to need something to cut it. Let's go ahead and open up your screw eyes here. And what we're going to do is right here, I'm going to open that up. Just open that up a little bit, just like that. Okay, now what you're going to do is put this in the end of your drill. All right. And that, that's tight enough for me. Now, let's get the first, first screw the um, screw I go on. So what you want to do, go ahead and pull you out some wire. Straighten that up the best you can. What I'm going to do here, guys, is this the way I've been this. I'm just going to do a normal, the very first one, a normal, normal one. Pull this down just like that. Kind of squeeze it together a little bit. Take my pliers. Grab it there. I'll take my screw gun and I'll twist it. Okay. Now, we have a normal a new normal screw. So off of this one, we're gonna pop another one, just bend that up like that. Bring this up, bring it back down. And do the same thing on this one, okay? There you go. There's a second one down. Bend it. Bend this back up, bend that back down, same thing, go ahead and screw it, go ahead and pop that out, okay, I mean it's literally, it's literally that easy, you guys can see, I'm making these super quick, it ain't taking any time at all. Um, this is a lot better than if I were to go, and sometimes it'll flip to the other side, but that's fine. It don't matter. Once you get these done, all you got to do, snip them, set them to the side, all right? And you can do these to your desired length. I know some guys like them longer, some guys like them shorter. It just depends on the size of the bait you're doing. Um, but as you guys can see, I got a couple more that fell, but I'll grab them. I made them screw eyes super quick. A lot of guys will take this, and what they'll do here is they'll get them a piece, and they'll cut it, and they'll take that, and they'll bend that down. And they'll hold that with pliers and do that. I just, I think that takes way more time to do. I'd just rather do it on one big spool. And then you cut them off individually. And as you see, you get one big spool here. You bend that, cut it, bend it, cut it, bend it and cut it. Um, I just think that's an easier process. Um, I got this, this wire here at Harbor Freight. It was real cheap. Um, I've been building baits with that for a while. Like I said, you can pick these up at your local hardware store or even online. Um, I recommend the thicker ones. If you try doing it with a thinner one, they're just going to break on you. So, hey guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, we're going to be doing a lot more bait builds. And we're going to do them on this channel here soon. A little something I worked on, but I, I ain't finished it yet. But, um, yeah guys. Stick around. If you haven't yet, 
like, comment, subscribe um, for future videos. We're getting this shop worked out. I got to paint the walls and do all this stuff to it. So once I get everything done, um, I'll show you that. And I want to show you guys a little jig I made real quick. And I'm going to make a separate video on that one. So check this out. So guys, as you can see, I got this little jig I made here. And I put what bait it's for right here. It's for this bait here. Um, but anyway, set that on there after you build your jig and then you know what it's for. But all it is is wood. This is all super glued on here. You can wood glue it and nail it and do whatever you need to. But I'm going to do a video on how to build one of these. And then it has a stop block right there. And that's the depth. As you see, it stops. But that's the depth that it cuts this. This just sits right there. Okay. And when this is running, this will go right through. And then it'll stop at the stopper. And that's how deep it is. So once you get that desired length, you pop that in there. And it stops. Okay. But that is a separate video. As I said, we're doing some drywalling and getting, we're going to get these walls painted um, as this was used for something else. But yeah, guys, I hope this video helps you out on the screw eyes for your baits a little bit. And um, hope you guys stick around. Um, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. Looking forward to seeing you in the future videos.